let me tell you a story. This story is about you, me and your dog. There was a time, I'd say a pretty long time ago, guess what? These cute cuddly dogs, the huge polis dogs and dogs as such did not exist. Now, they are the big ones, the small ones, the cuddlers, the hunters, the guardians and every kind of dog that you would possibly want. Now, how do you think that happened? How did we get from no dog to this? How did all of these dogs come to be? The answer is a transforming power that sounds something straight out of a fairy tale. Let's go back some 30,000 years, the time before dogs. Here, our ancestors lived through a time of endless winters. This was a time where our ancestors were wanderers and they slept beneath the stars. Their idea of home was Earth itself. But they lived in the fear of other wild creatures. The mountain lion, the bears that competed with them for the same prey. As time passed, humans started to live together in gatherings and they hunted together. Also, they were these wolves which generally wandered around these human gatherings. All that they wanted was the leftover meat and bones, but most of these wolves were also frightened of humans just like we were frightened of them. They were frightened to come close. Their fear was due to the high levels of the stress hormone in their blood. It was a matter of survival for them to be wary of humans. What if coming close to humans was fatal? But a few wolves, due to natural variation over time, had a lesser level of these hormones. This made them less afraid of humans. They started coming closer to humans and at that point, these wolves discovered an excellent survival strategy. Domestication by humans. They let the humans do the hunting. They didn't threaten the humans and because of their mellowed nature, the humans let them scavenge their garbage. Now, these wolves were able to eat more regularly. This was how they adapted to the situation and to the environment. They went from being wild to being tamed. This adaptation became stronger as generations passed and the wild wolves have now finally become dogs. Their purpose has changed and their looks have changed as well. You can call this survival of the friendliest. Then, as now, this was a good deal for us humans too. The dogs just don't scavenge anymore. They provide security too. They have become so cute that we now call them the man's best friend. If you like this video and want to watch many, many more amazing videos like these, like and subscribe to our channel now.